Hey guys, I saw this and I had to, you know, share it because it's becoming pretty cool. Uh, I don't know who originally wrote it, but uh, it's true about Texas and taxation being theft. And uh, it starts off as a song, then it tells you about all these different Texas, which are way too much Texas. Anyway, so I'm going to try to sing, I'm going to sing it. Texas land, Texas bed, Texas table on which he's fed, Texas tractor, Texas mule, teach him Texas are the rule. Texas work, Texas pay, he works for pennies anyway. Texas cow, Texas goat, Texas pants and his coat. Texas ties, Texas shirt, Texas work and Texas dirt. Tax the tobacco, tax the drinks, tax him if he tries to think. Tax his cigars, tax his beer if he cries, tax his tears. Tax his car, tax his gas, find other ways to tax his ass. Tax all he has and let him know that you won't be done till he has no dough. When he screams and hollers, hey, tax him even more dollars, yay. Tax him till he's good and sore, then tax his coffin some more. Tax his great, tax him till he's good and sore, then tax him some more. Then tax his coffin, tax his grave, tax the sod in which he's laid. Put these words upon a tomb. Tax has drove him to his doom. When he's gone, do not relax. It's time to apply an inheritance tax. Now, here's a bunch of the taxes that are in. The accounts receivable tax, the building permit tax, the CDL license tax, the cigarette tax, the corporate income tax, dog license tax, ex excess taxes, federal income taxes, the federal unemployment tax or FUDA, fishing license tax, food license tax, fuel permit tax, gasoline tax, which is, is currently, at this time, is 44.75 cents per gallon. You wonder why the price of gas is so high? Because of the taxes! That's why. Gross receipts tax, hunting license tax, inheritance tax, inventory tax, the IRS interest charges on and IRS penalties, which are taxes on top of taxes, and by the way, the IRS is unconstitutional. Congress is supposed to collect and levy taxes. Liquor tax, luxury taxes. Some of these sound like the stamp acts that uh, the founding fathers um, uh, said no taxation without representation, and they fought a revolution because of stamp acts. Luxury taxes, marriage license tax, Medicare tax, personal property tax, property tax, real estate tax, service charge tax, social security taxes, which by the way is also is a pyramid scheme, social security, road usage tax, recreational vehicle tax, sales tax, school tax, state income tax, state unemployment tax, or the SUDA. So you got to play a... And there, there's probably local income taxes, un, local income or unemployment taxes here or something. And here's for all the telephone taxes. Telephone federal exercise tax, the telephone federal universal service fee tax, the telephone federal state and local surcharge taxes, the telephone minimum usage surcharge tax, the telephone recurring and non-recurring charges tax, the telephone state and local tax, the telephone usage charge tax. And you wonder why your phone bill is so high. The utility taxes. And you wonder why your light gas and water bills are so high. Electric tax. Utility taxes, water taxes, vehicle license registration tax, vehicle sales tax, watercraft registration tax, well permit tax, workers' compensation tax. Still think this is funny? Guess what? 
Not one of these taxes existed a hundred years ago, and our nation was the most prosperous in the world. We had absolutely no national debt. We had the largest middle class in the world, and mom stayed home to raise the kids. What in the heck happened? Can you spell P-O-L-I-T-I-C-I-A-N-S? Politicians. Uh, we need more statesmen, not, not politicians. Hope this goes around the USA and over, maybe even the world at least 545 times. You can help it get there. Go ahead. Be an American. Share this video. Remember, God is good all the time, all the time. God is good. Keep on gaming. Keep on collecting. And why is there so much damn taxes? Oh my gosh, we need less taxes, more freedom. And you wonder why you don't have the money to live on. Because the government steals about half of it. That's why. Maybe more. Oh my gosh. Taxation is theft. Taxation is theft. Not to mention, oh my gosh, oh my, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, all, not to mention all the fees, all the licenses, you get have to have a license to do almost anything nowadays, and that's a tax, all the fees for not doing stuff to government standards or government qualifications, Fee, 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 fee. I'm faux fummed up with it. All of these taxes. Anyway, have a great day. Hope you enjoyed this video. Yay. That was good. All the time. Taxes are not good any at any time. Jesus loves you. Jesus is God. Now, Jesus did... Now, the Bible does say to submit to government authority. And Jesus did pay his taxes. And he does say, love your enemies. And pray for those who persecute you. So we definitely need to pray for these governments, people. We really need to pray that they'll start getting back to the Constitution and that they'll stop being tyrannical and oppressing the American citizens. In God's holy name of Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah! Praise Jesus! That's a good prayer. Anyway, if you're American, I dare you share this. I bet you didn't even know there was this many taxes, did you? Not to mention the... Uh, licensing to be able to do everything and the um, fees and the fines if you don't do it right those are taxes you have to pay a fee to be allowed to do it and then you have to pay a fine if you don't do it right catch 22 right taxation is theft It's legal theft. The only difference between the government taxing you is and throwing you in jail and a protection racket is the government's legal, has the legal right to do it. When the mafia and the crime syndicates and families and the gangs people do the exact same thing, in some cases, but it's illegal for them. Oh yeah, because it's legal for other people to do it. But it, it, I mean, it's illegal for anyone who... Oh, yeah, because the government doesn't like competition. That's why. Taxation is theft. Have a great day, guys and girls. Later. And, um... You want less taxes? Vote for statesmen.
and stop voting for politicians. Definitely quit voting for Democrats. Oh my gosh, Democrats are the ones that are the most tyrannical of the two parties. Jeez. They like to create more and more taxes. They like to create more and more laws, and if you don't obey them, more and more fees. And more and more fees to to just do simple things like build shit and make shit and create shit. Codes, 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 more, 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 more codes, which drive prices up. All in the name of safety. It's not about safety, y'all. It's about money. Money, 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 money. Republicans are the ones who cut taxes, but they don't do a good enough job. And libertarians are the ones who don't want any taxes at all. Or a very, very, very small consumption tax. And that's about it. Because they believe that we still need some form of government running. Oh, yeah. And, uh... you even know how much some of these politicians make a year? That's why we need term limits right there. One, they've been in office too many damn years. And two... They are so corrupt. Oh, my gosh. The politicians are making like $200,000 salaries a year, if not more. But somehow they're able to afford multi-million dollar mansions and estates and all this stuff. Makes no sense. 